Hello ladies and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to do a tutorial on this makeup look right here. This is the exact makeup I wore on the Christmas Eve and I love it so far. And as you can see, this is really bold. This is green, this is red and screaming of holiday season. And we are going to use this Christmas coffee limited edition from Too Faced. This is the palette right here. And this is really beautiful. I am a fan of Too Faced, the brand itself. I have so many eyeshadows with them. I started using them years and years ago and their formula never changed. They came up with this Christmas edition palette right here and this is really beautiful. You can also use this not only for Christmas but on a daily basis because majority of the color story here is very neutral so yeah this is what I'm going to wear today and by the way if you are new here on my channel welcome my name is Anna and I am a makeup lover so yeah please consider subscribing to my channel without further ado let's start with this makeup tutorial I already moisturized my face using my moisturizer as always the same moisturizer and now I am going to prime my face and I will be using this hourglass veil mineral primer I use my points sa Sephora to get this primer kasi gusto ko tong subukan uh, yeah this primer is really expensive and I don't want to spend my money on a primer uh, lalo na kapag hindi ko alam kung ano yung texture ano ba, nyo, ano ba yung longevity ng primer that's why it's a great opportunity kung uh, makakakuha kayo ng sample uh, to test out first the product. So, I will concentrate this here on the center of my face kung saan may um, visible yung aking mga pores. This primer is velvety, yung texture niya. Sobrang velvety. Para siyang silicon, but I don't think it's all silicon. Tapos may SPF 15 pa siya. So far, wala akong nakitang flashback sa aking uh, mga pictures kahit may SPF 15 to. Siguro dahil mababa lang yung SPF level niya. So now my face really feels smooth. Pero hindi siya parang silicone yung uh, na-review ko na product from Detail Cosmetics. Eto, it feels really smooth but it also feels like yung parang tacky na feeling. So, I think it's a good thing kasi hindi magi slide basta-basta yung aking foundation. And now for my foundation, I'm going to use this Double Wear foundation from Estee Lauder. Sobrang ganda nito sa photography. Napaka-flawless. So, hindi lang siya long wearing, maganda pa talaga siya sa photography. Okay, so I'm going to use my... This one, it's a buffing brush. And then I will go over with a sponge. Yeah, like this. And for concealer, I'm going to use two concealer. Ito para sa mga blemishes ko. This is from Happy Skin. And uh, for my under eye, I'm going to use this Too Faced Concealer. Uh, gustong gusto ko to sa under eye kasi nakaka-brighten siya ng under eye. Napansin ko lately, may eye bug ako. I'm not sure why. Siguro dahil late na kami natutulog. So, yeah. Hopefully, this concealer will help with my eye bug. And for my blemishes, I will use this Happy Skin Concealer. And, hindi ko ginamit yung Too Faced kasi sobrang puti nun. Hindi siya match sa mga blemishes ko. So, magpo-float yun. That's why I'm using a different concealer. Oops, there's more. Okay, next, I will use my cream blush from Natasha Denona. Ayan, so nag-post na rin ako ng review about this product. It's a very luxurious product. 
Yan. So, I'm using the blush and I'm going to use this brush. This is a really pretty blush. I can see that I will um, always use this in my video. So, sana hindi kayo magsawa. <laughs> kasi, para naman ma-ROI ko to. I mean, kasi mahal tong palette na to eh. Gusto ko gamitin to ng gamitin para bago siya mag-expire, nagamit ko na siya ng lubusan. As you can see, it's a really pretty blush. Yan. It's just giving me a natural flush na hindi siya overpowering. Alam nyo yun, yung super blushy. At the same time, hindi siya, alam nyo yun, hindi siya nagkikiki, walang patch. Really high-end quality product. So, I love this blush. So, next is bronzer. And I'm also going to use a cream bronzer. And this time is from... Fenty Beauty. This is the cream bronzer. <laughs> I will use the same brush. Yan. So, tap lang. Uh, I think I got the wrong shade here. Kasi, anong shade ba to? I got the, this shade, Butter Biscuit, which is number 2. And I feel like this is very light for my skin tone. So, hindi siya masyadong kita. But, uh, kung ibibuild ko siya, ayun, nakikita ko siya sa skin ko. Yan. So, I will use my, sp my sponge para mas malakas yung pigmentation. So, I will concentrate this on my forehead kung saan nagko-contour. Yan. Medyo dark siya sa pan. Pero, kapag na-apply na siya sa skin, hindi siya ganun ka-dark. This is actually really good for everyday use. Kasi, yun nga, hindi siya ganun ka-dark. So, pwede nyong gamitin to uh, at daytime. Hindi siya masyadong halata. Kung napapansin nyo, lahat cream products yung ginamit ko. Kasi... Lately, I am experimenting with cream products and I noticed na mas maganda palang gamitin ang cream products. Feeling ko mas naglalast yung aking makeup kapag uh, puro creams yung ginamit ko. Although I will go over with powder later. But I feel like uh, whenever I use creams, mas long lasting yung aking makeup. I'm also using this cream bronzer to contour my nose a little bit. Next, I will go over my bronzer using the Hourglass Bronzer. Yan, paubos na siya. I feel sad kasi I love this bronzer. Ayan, paubos na siya. Kailangan ko na naman ulit bumili. And this bronzer from Hourglass is really expensive. That's why I'm kind of sad. And happy at the same time na naubos ko siya. And next is powder. So, for powder, I will use my Perfect Diary Powder. This is in the shade uh, number 5. So, ito yung parang, ayan, parang nude siya. Ito ang aking favorite na powder. Kasi pag ito yung ginagamit kong powder, hindi talaga ako nag-oily. Okay, next highlighter, I will go back again with my Natasha Denona palette and I will use this highlighter here kasi sobrang ganda niya. Ngayon lang ako nakagamit ng ganitong kagandang highlighter as in. Ayan, can you see that? Sobrang ganda niya talaga. This is now my favorite highlighter. So, I will highlight this. Oops, napadami siya. Okay. Okay. 
And for my eyebrows, I use this Detail Cosmetics Super Fine Liner. Ooh, liner pala ang tawag dito. Okay, so I will just do my eyebrows very quickly and then I will be... Eyebrow right. mascara, I'm going to use this Vice Cosmetic Eyebrow Mascara. At may bago kong technique na nalaman. Bago ko siya i-apply yung pag na stroke. And ito muna yung ginagawa ko. So, I'm parang back comb ng aking eyebrow hair para may coat din yung ilalim. Napansin ko, pag ginagawa ko tong routine, hindi masyadong bumabagsak yung aking eyebrow hair. Kasi, as you can see, masyadong mahaba yung aking eyebrow hair. Uh, saglit lang bumababa kaagad. Pero, pag ganitong technique yung ginagawa ko, mas, al alam nyo yun, mas matagal siyang nandun sa taas, hindi ka agad-agad bumababa. Katapos kong i-vacuum yung aking eyebrow hair, saka ko na siya aayusin according to its shape. Ayan. This is really perfect for my eyebrow hair kasi mahaba yung aking eyebrow hair. Mas matagal bumababa kapag ganitong technique yung ginagawa ko. So, okay, so now we are ready for the eyeshadow. So for the eyeshadow, I want to keep it fun. And that's what we are going to do since this is a holiday season. So why not wear a color eyeshadow for this season, right? And we are going to use this one, this Christmas Coffee uh, Limited Edition from Too Faced. Ayan. So meron siyang green color here. Uh, this is what we are going to use. As you can see, this palette is really versatile. So hindi lang siya pang uh, holiday season. Pwede pwede nyo rin to gamitin. Uh, on a daily basis kasi most of the shadows here are very neutral. So. First, I will just prime my eye. I will use the same primer. Ewan ko kung pwede rin to as eye primer. But this is the closest. So, I'm gonna use this primer from Hourglass para mas smooth lang natin ang ating eyelid. First, I'm going to take this color here. Yan. So, hindi ito. Ito medyo pinkish siya. And, I will set that primer. Yan. So, para lang siyang skin tone ko. So, wala siyang masyadong color. I just want to set the primer para uh, smooth yung application ng next eyeshadow that we are going to use. So, next color I will use is this one here. Ayan. So, this will be my transition color. This will go all over here. Ayan. So, dito ko siya ilalagay above my crease kasi medyo chinita ako. Ayan. Para kahit nakadilat ako, nakikita pa rin yung aking eyeshadow. Ayan. Can you see? Okay, so I will do my other eye. And I will also bring this shade here para may contour ng konti. Ayan. Can you see that? Next color I will use is this one here. So, para tong terracotta. Para siyang pumpkin color. Ayan. This will go here. Dito lang sa baba ng crease. Para mas define yung aking crease. So, na-darken ng konti yung aking crease. As you can see. Next color I will use is this one here. So, para tong chocolate brown. Ito naman dito sa outer corner. Kasi gusto ko medyo smoky yung aking eye look. And so, I will put it here. And then, I will blend it inwards. Yan. Para ma-diffuse yung color ng brown. Kasi pigmented yung eyeshadow ng Too Faced. Too Faced eyeshadow is one of my favorite as well sa mga high-end brands. Matagal ko nang ginagamit ang Too Faced. I have lots and lots of palette from Too Faced. Kasi maganda yung quality ng eyeshadow nila. Yan. So, yan. As you can see, kapag didilat ako, hindi siya masyadong nakikita. Pero... Kapag tumingin ako sa baba, ayan siya. Ayan. So, diffuse ko lang ng konti yung kulay dito. 
And I will also bring this down here, dito sa lower lash line. So I'm just coming back again to this uh, brush. This is from Macy's, kasi gusto ko ma-blend yung edge para hindi masyadong harsh yung edge ng ating uh, brown eyeshadow. Okay, so next color I will use is this one here. This is a really beautiful champagne uh, golden shade here. So this will go in my inner corner. Yan, kita nyo? Ganda. Okay, so for the fun part, siguro nagtataka kayo, nasa na yung green? Akala ko ba gagamit tayo ng green? So, uh, I will now use the green eyeshadow and I will use this base first. This is a cream eyeshadow from Revlon. This is the Revlon Color Stay in uh, the shade Peacock Pawn. Pawn? Pawn? Hindi ko alam. Yan. So, I will use this in my inner corner dito sa baba ng lash line. Kasi, uh, napansin ko, kapag dederecho ko yung eyeshadow, hindi siya ganun kakapit. At mas vibrant kung gagamit ako ng cream eyeshadow. Kaya, yun yung gagawin natin ngayon. Okay, so sana nakikita nyo. Okay, so I will use this here. Oops. Okay. I will also run this uh, dito sa buong lower lash line ko. Although meron na akong brown eyeshadow, it's okay. I will run this here. Pero mas concentrated dito sa inner corner kasi gusto ko dito talaga mag-pop yung green. Ayan. So now we have the base. Pwede na natin ilagay yung green eyeshadow. Okay, so I will use the same brush kasi precise itong brush. Actually, this is a lip brush pero ginagamit ko siya sa uh, para sa eyeshadow dahil maliit nga yung aking mata. So, bagay na bagay to kapag uh, gusto ko ng precise na application ng eyeshadow. And this eyeshadow, ayan, so mag-swatch lang ako. Ayan. So, this one is without the cream eyeshadow. Ayan, subukan kong maglagay ng cream eyeshadow and then I will tap this off. Makikita nyo yung difference. Ayan. So, this is the green eyeshadow and this is the cream uh, eyeshadow from Revlon. Ngayon, lalagyan natin to ng uh, yung eyeshadow from Too Faced. Makikita nyo yung difference. Ayan. So, I tap it off with the green eyeshadow from Too Faced. As you can see, ang ganda niya. Para siyang monochrome na lumabas compared kapag ito lang parang flat parang green lang siya pero pag um, I put it on top of the cream eyeshadow mas lalo siyang gumanda kaya ang ganda niyang tingnan yan so now I will apply it to my inner corner Now, I will just go back with that brown eyeshadow. I-blend ko dito ng konti kasi, ay, napasobra yung ating green. Okay, so that's the eyeshadow. Ngayon naman, eyeliner. Okay, so for my eyeliner, I'm going to use this eyeliner from Tevian. This is also green. Ayan. So, para siyang forest green. Ayan. Yan, so this is the eyeliner. Looks like hindi siya ganun ka kita. Nag-green siya. Kasi nga parang forest green. Lalo na kapag chinita. So hindi talaga siya halata. Na yeah, but this eyeliner is really nice. It's long lasting. It will last you throughout the night. Kahit uh, umiyak pa kayo sa kakatawa. Nandyan pa rin yung eyeliner. For my mascara, I will use again my Maybelline False Lash Lift. Kasi ito yung aking favorite. Ayan. So, hindi pa siya napapalitan. And this gives me the false lash effect. Hindi ko na kailangan mag-false lashes. Kasi hindi ako marunong mag-false lashes. It's a good excuse din not to wear false lashes. 
Okay, so this is our eye look. As you can see, it's green, it's bold, and it's screaming holiday season. And of course, we are going to do a bold red lip to pair this bold eyeshadow look. Yeah, so I'm going to use this lip liner first from Mason. This is in red. Yeah, this is in Amelie. This is the red color. Now, I will go over with this Fenty Beauty Lip Stana. This is very red. Yan. Whoa, look at that color. So red. Okay, so this completes the look. And before we will end this video, I will spray my favorite perfume, which is the Coco Mademoiselle from Chanel. Now this completes the look. This is the exact look I wore in the uh, Christmas Eve and the same dress. Yeah, hindi masyadong kita sa pictures na ganito yung aking eye look kasi I have very small eyes. Walang nakikita sa picture ko ano yung aking eye makeup. But yeah, this is the exact eye look I wore on the Christmas Eve. And I love it so far. But in this tutorial, I exage a little bit on my lower lash line. Para naman makita nyo sa video yung color and also my eyeliner. Hindi ganito kakapal yung aking eyeliner uh, that day. But yeah, these are all the colors I wore during Christmas Eve. So what do you think? Do you like this? Do you like not? Uh, let me know in the comment down below. So that's it, you ladies. Thank you for watching. I hope you consider subscribing to my channel and like this video. Thank you and have a good holiday. Bye!